Ahojte, volám sa Dalibor, vítam vás pri ďalšom videu. Hi everybody, welcome to Los Angeles, California, along with Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. The Blues have a quick turnaround as they're right back into the fire tonight, Ray. Sometimes the team on the back-to-back -back plays really well early, like they're into the game. Eventually, though, you run out of gas, and that's where you have to watch what happens in a back-to-back -back scenario. LA's got it in the offensive zone. From point blank, he scores! The captain leading by example! LA sent an early message. You are not welcome here tonight. The road team always worries about the first 10 minutes. Man, they didn't even get out of the first minute, and they're down one. Pinned up along the boards. Has some nice footwork wow. to free the puck up to his teammate. They've got numbers. Makes the save. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. 1-0 the score. St. Louis wins the draw. And now he moves it to Tarasenko. St. Louis is in the offensive zone. Excellent stick work on the play. The Kings scoop it up along the boards. They've got the defense outnumbered. And that's picked off in front. Pareko's got the puck through the neutral zone. Manages to hang on. Right to the middle. And they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Puck scooped up by Pareko. Gaining steam inside the neutral zone. The Blues looking against the half wall. Moves right to the middle. Here's a shot. Big time stop. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. LA's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. And he gets in the lane to block that. And now it's grabbed by Gustafson. And it's a quick pass to Kopitar. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. With the stop. And they can't convert to the play. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. The Kings win it. Puck grabbed by Gustafson. No room for that one to get through. The Blues have it now. Works it across to Tarasenko. Breakaway. Oh, talk about a missed opportunity. He beat the puck square. He doesn't get a shot on goal on a breakaway. Thunder is hit in the wall. Doughty's got it in the defensive end. Gets the puck over to Tarasenko. A chance! And puts it high! All right, goalie had to dock that thing with so high. And here's the pass to Aliou. Couldn't catch up to that pass. St. Louis plays it along the wing. The Kings gain possession along the wall. LA's on the attack. Here in the late going of the frame, LA's got a 2-0 lead. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Stops him cold! Los Angeles wins the draw here in the offensive zone. And that's blocked away. St. Louis looks to break out in their own end. The Kings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Carter's got it along the wing. Quick stop by Riddick. There's the whistle from referee Gilles Levesque and a penalty coming up that'll do it for the power play. The Kings are off to the box. Interference the call. That's one of those, instead of arguing, all you can do is go, ah, I'm in the wrong spot. You turn around and go sit down. I believe my mother called it, lump it. Both teams had a chance to recharge. And the official set to drop the puck here on period number two. The Blues can't convert on the power play. Both sides are back to even strength. Out front, and they can't connect. Grabbed along the board by Kopitar. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. 
Here's a short pass to O'Reilly. Oh, smart heads off play to poke that one away. St. Louis tries to break out from their own end. Perron's going to play it against the half wall. Comes up with the stop. Quick feed to Johansson. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Lots of time left in this period. Los Angeles leads it 2-0. The Kings take possession off the faceoff. And he slides it quickly to Dowdy. From the right side, they gain the zone. Pokes it away in his own end. Slides the puck down low. Quick pass to Aliou. Unloads the shot! They score! Living up to their name! The sharpshooter line delivers again! These guys are so good when they get into the offensive zone. They think goal, and they know how to make it happen. Dare I say, it's like the excellence of execution out there. Ray, you're between the benches. Are you picking up on any of this? Yeah, I, I thought a really good reminder here from the coach to his youngest player is that you're at a point in the game where safety is better than a creative play. Make the right play the smart play. Keep the puck in front of you. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. We've got a penalty coming up on the play. Alley has been nabbed for tripping. And by number 23, Dustin tries to feed it over to Cogliano. Considered a win for the penalty killers as the power play fails to execute. And nobody's going to be very happy about that one, James. No real chances generated. No momentum game. Just a couple of minutes roll off the clock. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, LA's got a three-goal lead. Too much congestion blocks the shot. The Blues take it across the blue line. Great poke check on the reach. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. Takes the feed. And that's a paddling from the goaltender. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. St. Louis still trails here in the second despite the fact that they've had more shots on goal. Kopitar's won it off the faceoff. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Los Angeles has it against the half wall. There he is from the slot. Misses a golden opportunity there. Now he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Cutting to the slot. Passes on over to Brown. Moves it to Kopitar. Jabs the puck away. Maintains possession. Sends the pass over. Oh, makes the save! That was a rocket! It's been a tightly contested affair this far as the period comes to an end. Two down. One to go. Third period. They're ready to drop the puck. Here we go, put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period, we are underway. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? The Blues are behind in this game, James, after two periods, and really for me, it's no surprise. They've turned the puck over constantly tonight. And a strong effort on that play. Oh, I like this stop here. He makes the save, he looks in control, and the rebound third scores! You get one, you get hungry for a second one. Even if you're not a goal scorer, you get that early, now you want to hunt for a second goal. Makes it a double on the play. He doesn't miss too many, James. He leads his team in goals for a reason. Let's go back to ringside. Ray Ferraro standing by. What are you catching out there? I'm looking at a team here that's pretty satisfied with some of their players tonight. The coach came over, gave the rookie a tap on the shoulder as he came in off that last shift. I like the fact that he had a job to do. The coach told him what to do, and the kid was able to deliver. Taken by Crew. Slides it over to Pareko. Passes it to O'Reilly. From in close. Oh, a clutch save. Look out. 
Drills them. That's generally a no-fly zone with star players. Yeah, they get hit like that. Somebody's going to get irritated. And guess what happens when they get irritated? Down go the mitts. Go time. Absolutely rocked down to the ice there. That was a heavy blow, and that is the end of this bout. And here comes referee Gilles Levesque to clean things up. Oh, that'll do it, and you can tell who won. Listen to the building. Well, with the chaos cleared, face-off now for both teams. Shen's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Gets in front of it. LA's got it in their own zone. Quick pass to Aliou. Man, when you got two goals, it's your night. You want to look for a third one. He's got the puck in the offensive zone again. Takes a shot. Stones him with the blocker. Scrum along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Shen. A chance right in front. Denies him in close. Kopitar has been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. Musa quickly over to chase on. Alou's eyes are looking for three. He's got two in his back pocket. Dangerous player now. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Shen's going to the box for tripping. He's fishing around, trying to get to the puck. Unfortunately for him, he sweeps out his feet. Uh -huh. Los Angeles is ready to go back to work on special teams. You gotta have a short memory on a power play. You haven't scored yet tonight, but that can't matter on this one. Get the puck back to the point, start moving it around and get people converging at the net. Nice poke check. The Blues have it from their own end. St. Louis with possession in their own zone. Slides it across to Perron. Gains the zone on the left wing. Here's a short pass to Gustafson. The Kings are on the attack. Here's a chance. Fires the wrist shot. Denies him in front with a kick save. St. Louis moves ahead with the puck. The Blues penalty has expired. They now go to work on the power play. Comes up with a big plus save. Hamannick's lugging the puck. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Centering pass, and there's the save. And the puck clears the zone. St. Louis has it near the wall. Quick feed to Dunn. Gives them nothing in front. Ray, they've got a comfortable lead here. What's the strategy down the stretch? Well, the strategy for me is that you can't be too conservative. The coach is talking to them about being smart with the puck, and that's fine, but you have to stay up on your toes. He's gone to the kid a couple of times and reminded him no fancy plays. The Sharks are the final test on this road trip. There's been some heavy ones on it as well, and the games don't get any easier. When you get to the end of the trip, you just don't have the energy you did a few games ago. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Receives the pass. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. Riddick's really had a difficult time tonight. He's not looked comfortable. Even in warm-up, I thought he was a little bit shaky. He makes a good save there to keep his team somewhat in the game. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play. If you're not sure what's going on, freeze the puck. The Blues have been the busier team in the offensive zone, but they still trail in the third. Angles it over to Kopitar. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Shot! Oh, what an insane stop by Riddick! And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Quick pass to Ryan. And he gains the zone here. Pass back to the point. Big save! Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. St. Louis desperate for some offensive conversions here late in this third period. Kopitar's won a big draw in their own end. Gains the zone from the right. Here's an odd man rush. Stopped by the goaltender. Thomas takes it through the middle of the ice. Strong defensive effort. The Kings gain control of the puck against the wall. 
McDermott's got it on the offensive end. The Blues get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Centering pass. The glove making it look easy on the play. Just here in the late stages of this frame, and it's been a pretty one-sided affair to this point. It's 4-1. Puck has dropped and we are back underway. LA is playing it through center. This incredibly one-sided contest finally reaches its final minute. The, third period. the Blues take it along the wall. Oh, what a heads up play to poke it away.